Howdy y'all, welcome to System Test 7. MS5UD is still here, as well as the BG12. But I changed out the EHEL1 for the Commander 2 that used to be in the kitchen, except it's set on Chime, so that's cool. Same BG12, and have the Spectre Alert that used to be in the laundry room. Set for Code 3, and it is a fixed 1575 strobe as you can see. We'll go out here and we'll go ahead and start the system test. The panel is set for system sensor sync. Both of these alarms are wired for two wire operation which means I can use this selective silence feature on the MS5UD. Without further ado let's get this started. In three, two, one. Step outside. You can hear it outside too. It's quite loud outside. All right. That's still flashing too, and both of the strobes are flashing with, or both of the strobes are flashing uh, on two wire, which is awesome. Selective so silence is pretty cool, although it's illegal now, but I don't care. And they're kind of synced, they're not like super synced up, but it's better than no sync at all. Reset the pull station. Come on, buddy. There you go. <laughs> and then we will reset, and then I tell you what we're gonna do. We're gonna do a walk test, because I haven't done a walk test in a while. As you can see, it says Pulsation Garage Zone 1, as always. And reset. And they turn off. And then we'll go into the programming. Scroll down to walk test, and then we'll do audible. I need my talent key, there we go. All right. You also notice the uh, Panel's power makes the spectral alert sound kind of weird, but it's whatever. It's just how it is. Okay, pull down. Better reset it before it goes off again. I want to actually try something. I suppose we will go in here and reset the panel. No, actually we'll go to escape and then view result. So garage and then kitchen worked, obviously. We'll hit reset. And system all normal. I'm not going to test the key station because I tested that last system test. All right, guys, that's going to be it for now. Thanks for watching.